Hello and welcome to the video for what is flow control the gate node. I've created a pretty simple example here. Basically we are at the entrance of a theme park and the gates are not open yet because it's not opening time. So anyone who wants to go through the gate cannot get in. Once we open the gate now people can get in. But at a certain point we might have too many people so we're going to need to close that gate and now no one else can get back in. So let's run through that quick example here. This is pretty simple. The gate node itself has an enter, open, close, toggle, and a bool variable called start closed. The gate node is intended to allow things to execute only when it's open. Once it is closed, nothing goes on and you have an easy ability to toggle it on and off. So right here, when we start, we click our enter button. Someone tries to go in, but because we're starting closed, this execute will never fire and it will continue on no matter how many times or how hard we click that button. We need to open it first. Anything that fires and hits the open execute input will then open the gate. Now that the gate's open, everything can freely flow out of the exit gate execute wire. Once we hit our certain limit, we click our close button, which fires off the close input. And now the gate is closed again and nothing will fire. If, for example, you wanted to not have an open and close, but simply a toggle, you could fire it into the toggle and this will switch the state between open and closed. That's it. Gate's nice if you, for example, we could have changed this over here to check and see if we're maybe at 25 people, our maximum capacity. If we are, we could automatically fire the close. And basically, once we hit that maximum amount, this gate will close and it's all done automatically. Gate is nice for a nice even flow control. If you want to allow things to continue until you hit a certain criteria and then you want to stop. 